Well, this is it. I look insane, which is a perfect. Uh, I have three cigarettes left that I found. So I thought I would do for my last scope. I just smoke them all <laughs> and be done with it. Argentina, wow. That's uh, Argentina is such an incredible place. I don't think I realized that until the top year special. I didn't realize, uh, I thought that I was going to be breaking news to people by saying the Periscope was going away. But I'm assuming that everybody encountered the banner when you open the app. Um, I let Periscope down in a big way because, well, I mean, not that anyone would have read it, but uh, I was going to write an essay about how Periscope is almost, like, at least my experiences. I know that a lot of people had different ones, but have been, like, 100% positive on Periscope. Um, and yet I hardly, <laughs> hardly ever have opened it in the past few years. So I guess, uh, I guess I can still write that essay, but, um, hey, Greg, I'm, I know that I follow you in other places, so what do you think about Twitter killing the Periscope app? I can't speak Spanish. I wish I could. Um, Twitter Live is just, oh, really? That's weird. I'm sorry, speaking Spanish to me will not fix the problem that I am unilingual, alingual. Well, send me an email or something. I mean, I guess, I don't know. It's, it's, uh... That's, oh, Jesus. Oh, man. You should, um, see if you can get in contact with Ariana Grande. Mm-hmm. Because usually those artists, you probably have to go through like three different layers of people. Be like, hey, I bet Ariana would like ballooning. Jesus. I'm sorry, that's awful. Um, it's a weird instinct to be like, I can't lose touch, even though we only interact like once every few months. Um, but this app was really a special one. Uh, okay. my If you go to facebook.com slash asphalt apostle, you can add me if you want. That's probably the easiest. I'm sorry, my Argentinian friend, I, I can't. Um, I, well, see, I don't drink anymore. <laughs> if I was drinking, I would probably cry. Um... I can't even save this broadcast anymore. The last one, the last one just saved like a bunch of... Yeah, so this is... I've quit smoking. 
I found three more cigarettes. I said I was going to smoke them all on the scope. I think I'm going to smoke two. And that'll be it. Forever. Um, I didn't smoke a cigarette for like a week. I smoked one last night. Well, thanks. I guess I am too. Um, I don't like what it's doing to my teeth. Hey, Akbar. I, uh... So I figured that this would be the one, this would be the place to smoke the the, la the very last cigarettes in my possession. I looked literally everywhere else, so that's no good at all. That's, it, like, honestly, I don't want to go to the dentist. I'm terrified of going to the dentist. You know what I do have to do, though? Um, I have to hang out on Periscope some more and <laughs> offload my stars, because I still have, like, $10 worth of stars. Um, back when I had money, um, yeah, I mean, braces, that's awful. I promise, yeah, I, you know, I'm not enjoying this at all. These, like, so last night was the first cigarette that I'd smoked in, like, a week, and it was utterly disgusting. This is, I mean, it just doesn't taste the same at all as it does when you're actually smoking. Um, it's, I mean, yeah. Okay, that's one. I think I'm going to leave one, I guess. Because I don't want to smoke three cigarettes in a row. Um, not quite. I basically did that once. Maybe even worse. My girlfriend had put out cigarettes in a Red Bull can um, without explicitly marking it in any way, and I took a swig. Um, that was that should have probably been the moment that I stopped. Uh, it was not pleasant, but yes. Um, now I've just been vaping, which is almost more expensive. Um, the way that I've been cutting back on that is by putting the vape across the room and making myself get up instead of just hitting it all the time. But there's going to be a moment where I'm just going to have to be like, chewing ice, that's a good idea. Um, there's going to have to be a moment where... I just run out of everything and I just deal with it. Um, in theory, that would be now. Uh, I guess, yeah. I think I have like two pods left. Um, I don't know. But yeah, so... Um, Yes. Well, I'm back. I mean, I've been in Columbia for like two years. I think you know this. Jesus, or more. Been back home. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm here. I I will remain here for the rest of my life. I'm pretty sure about that. Um, or at least I'm content. Uh, Having, having gone into the big, big world and not understood it at all. That's a great idea. Pakistan. See, this is... Hello. Um, I can't think of a single other social application which has connected me to, to so many people randomly across the globe. Um... Yeah. Uh, if I could drive, I've also, <clears throat> I got in an accident almost exactly a year ago, a little bit over a year ago, uh, and had my license suspended, except they won't call it suspended, so I haven't driven a, an automobile in a year. Not even to, like, drive it down the driveway. I haven't, I have, uh, 
So I feel you. Definitely. Um, well, yeah, the accident. Here you go. <laughs> Doing great. I'm, I'm making great choices. Yeah, this is the first time I've ever actually had airbags deploy, ever. Not only that, but the uh, the battery cut off deployed. Am I just living? No, I am living in my mother's house again. My poor mother in the smallest room that's not a closet in the house. Uh, completely sober. Um, I did go to school for the semester. I don't, I'm not going to be going back the next semester, I don't think. Um, yeah, that's what I tell, I tell myself that. Um, I also help her with her private practice, or at least try. Uh, all the people that, that were on Periscope to learn English... Um, oh, private practice. Uh, she's a, she's a therapist. She's a EMDR therapist. Um, this definitely isn't satisfying anything. It's just, I mean, yeah, well, thank you. I'm, I, I hope. I've uh, spent the past few days trying to figure out how to take this huge batch of patient files from one practice management s software to another. Me neither. <laughs> um, thank you, Greg. I appreciate that sentiment. I've been telling myself that for a few years now. Just keep going. Uh, I actually... This is very disturb not disturbing. It sounds heavier than it is, I'm, ass I'm assuming. I went to see an EMDR therapist, a uh, co colleague-ish of my mom's. She'd met like twice. Uh, and on the third session, she said, I'm scared of what's inside you. You're angry. And I was like, oh my god. <laughs> like, uh, I, you know, do you want me to, like, I don't know. That seemed a little off to me, but maybe she was... No, no, um, never been... And that's the thing, is I, uh, I literally don't, like, have violent urges in day-to-day -day life. Um, yeah, yeah. I'm just trying not to... Sh break anything um thank you guys by the way for hyping me up see periscope is better than therapy i don't know if that's entirely true um i i've met so many people that i haven't spoken to in a long time but used to speak to regularly on periscope uh, some of them still broadcast and I don't really know what I was saying before is like Twitter live just doesn't have the discovery thing. Doesn't have the community thing. Um, really? Have they talked about where they're going to go? I really wish that I... Um, that's, yeah, I mean, that's honestly, like, that's my favorite content on Periscope. Um, well, actually, I shouldn't say that. I don't really know if I have, I haven't gone on it very often, but er, as I've said, every time I have opened the app, I just go look at the map live only and just pick a random one. Uh, I've been biased toward the United States because it starts in the U.S., right? But uh, the last one that I found 
Corona scope. Okay, can I? Still get, getting used to. It. I. So, EMDR is supposed to. Um. So my mom has has. Uh, things that attach to your wrist, both wrists, and they alternate. Yeah, I, I, uh, oh, that's cool. I would love to see a Greg hosted scope again. Um, my theory is that, okay, I guess I am going to smoke the last one. Last, the last cigarette ever. Scary. Ugh. Um, my theory is that uh, my just playing around on the piano kind of substitutes for EMDR. Um, I don't know. Yeah, so there's it's all they look like wearables, and they alternate at different uh, paces, and then she has a light bar. It's got a string of LEDs, and they track back and forth. Um, and that's, like, I when she first started doing this, uh, I was just like, this is just hypnosis. Like, um, but it's definitely not. Uh, I don't know whether I am, like, layers of an onion sh Shrek, too many layers yeah, okay, well, I have a peeve where any anything tapping me on the wrist or, like, fucking with my wrists, um, that do doesn't actually make me violent, but it does make me, does irritate me very quickly, which is why I can't wear wearables, even if I wanted to. But, uh... Y you know, I, my mom um, is unlike any therapist that I've ever any other therapist that I've ever met and that, that it sounds like, and I don't, I don't listen on her sessions. Um, but there's like often a lot of laughing or, and she's laughing with, she's definitely not the stoic therapist type. Um, yeah, I, I don't think that EMDR, I think EMDR is like, Uh, I, I'm sure for some people it is what they came here for. It seems like there are a lot of clients that just kind of, yeah, definitely subjective. There are a lot of clients that forego it. I don't know. I try to pick up as, as little of her sessions as I can. <laughs> um, but, yeah, I... I tried to, I really tried to be as sincere as possible when I tried it. I tried the wrist thing and the light bar. And I still couldn't, I was trying to stop myself from laughing. And I guess it's just a very odd um, situation to find oneself in. And... Yeah. Well, I'm, yeah. Obviously, I think it's, it is a, apparently it's, at least clinically, the only treatment for PTSD. Of course, Greg, thank you for stopping by. Um, add me on Facebook. Which, I haven't checked in months. I, um... Yeah, I probably should be social again. <laughs> Basically, all of my... Any of my socializing was based around drinking. So... Um, okay. I'll just... I've been there before.
Um, yeah. Yeah. That's... I, uh... I spent all summer writing about... I wrote a, the big Facebook essay. I was touting it up, and it was basically going down... Me too. I miss my Jaguar very much. I miss uh, just hanging out after work at the gas station, drinking. Um, I what of the archive I did have, I did put publicly on YouTube, and I didn't realize that when you do that now, um, they all show up as the newest videos. So that's the thing is. That, there's not really any value to rewatching them be because there's no chat and because they're not live. But whatever, I could do it, so I did. Um, the thing, okay, so Facebook though, let me just say this one thing. The thing I realized after reading some academic papers is that um, the thing that differs Facebook's design from most other software that you use, web or not, um, is that, is basically Facebook is designed to steer you. So one of the things that I've complained about for a long time is give me any task on Facebook. Um, let's say I want to post a photo to one, to boiler explosion memes, my Facebook group. I go to facebook.com. How do I do that? I can't. I go to the search bar and type in videos, and it's uh, there'll be like a shortcut that someone made that looks like the video's logo, and it used to have that functionality in native Facebook, but it doesn't anymore. I basically uh, there's no one static way to to accomplish any task on Facebook, and the reason that is, it's because Facebook. Um, like is explicitly designed to uh, basically to tell you where to go. Yeah. Um, words with friends. Um, farm bill. Uh, but yeah, the, I don't know if I actually communicated that. Basically, it's like an aggressive. It's an aggressive design philosophy. In its, in its user experience. Farmville? Um, I mean, I, I honestly don't even know enough to be judgmental anymore. Uh, actually, in retrospect, I remember making fun of Farmville in like 2012, but the thing is, from what I know about it, it's probably really therapeutic. Words with friends. No, I... Okay. Um, unfortunately, there really aren't any alternatives to Facebook that fulfill its function. There could be, though. Okay, um, no, I'll finish this. Um, but thank you guys for hanging out for years. Um... It was fun. You too. Of course. We'll keep in touch. I'm sure the internet is vast, but there is only one... There's only one man in the world named Greg who balloons. <laughs> oh. Okay. Jesus. I have to bathe again. I don't hate balloons anymore. I don't even... I don't even... Like, I'm not funny anymore. Or, or quick. So, my my funny balloon-hating rant. When I, I've tried it recently, and it doesn't work anymore. With the long pauses. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna say goodbye to, to Periscope forever.
Thank you. Uh, I hope that something else comes along like this. All right. Goodbye, Scope.